guys welcome to my channel so today i am out here i needed some plant energy and surround myself with beautiful beautiful plants so i'm visiting this nursery that is close to my house i come here quite often and i usually just like to immerse myself in all this greenery and um, you know really enjoy being in here even though i don't pick up anything new to take home i usually just come here to fill my cup so just wanted to bring you along today and show you some of these beautiful beautiful plants that they have here um, i am actually checking out some of these succulents today i am actually planning on getting a succulent today and i thought i would take you along and show you what i was going to buy they are not really named i don't see any names on these so i'm not really sure what varieties they are but they have a lot of selection for succulents and what i love about succulents is that they are low care i mean they do not like too much fuss with water and they if, as long as you give them a bright spot they are generally happy with drier soil conditions and that's what i love about house plants things that are easy uh, lower maintenance and doesn't don't require too much care so i just love succulents for that reason and uh, yeah look at the selection here um, and i think i'm going to pick pick one up I'm not really sure which one yet but um, this one is really catching my eye over there so might be that one i'm so sorry if it's really noisy in here but um, they are getting things ready for their um, gardening season and perennials but i just love being in this lush greenhouse and enjoying these beautiful beautiful plants look at the size of this bird of paradise like it's just beautiful and ginormous I don't think something like this would even fit in my house, but I love looking at it and I love admiring it while I'm here. So it's beautiful and gorgeous, um, really, really nice. Look at these crotons, aren't they like so beautiful and so colorful and gorgeous? But these bromeliads look so pretty as well and so gorgeous. Um, and uh, yeah, and it's just so beautiful in here and gorgeous and look at these palms in the back here it just reminds me that i'm in some tropical tropical jungle it's gorgeous love 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 them so yeah i just wanted to give you a quick view of what i was looking at there is ton more here they have lots and lots of other plants they have ferns they have Kinds of stuff you name it they have it in here and it's just stunning so beautiful and, uh, they have a really nice waterfall as well which adds to the ambience and it's really 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 serene and beautiful in here I hope you can hear what I'm saying uh, but regardless I just wanted to take you along and show you what I was looking at isn't this so beautiful I love how the color is so dark and it has this variegation with a pink purple pink line in the middle it's gorgeous I actually picked up one of these a few couple of months ago and um, it's struggling a little bit at home but I really liked it and um, trying to baby it a little bit so that it'll it'll start to look as good as they look in this greenhouse so really really beautiful gorgeous just wanted to give you a little little piece of this heaven here and i hope everyone is enjoying this and i will share with you the plant that i am purchasing today when i get home and show you show you that plant look at these fiddle leaf figs aren't they beautiful love it i love the spider plant as well it's so beautiful and so um it's so simple but it's so magnificent for me it's so gorgeous so so gorgeous and they have really nice photos as well um, and they're all stunning and beautiful love them I'm back home from the nursery and this is the plant that I came home with it is a type of a succulent I think possibly in the jade family they weren't able to give me 
a name for this plant because they just have so many succulents that they, they said they don't really name each of them because there are so many varieties. But I kind of looked this one up and I think it's probably part of either a sedum or jade family. Um, and it has uh, beautiful thick succulent leaves. And what I love about it is the blooms. Like it is the most, let me just see if I can focus in, most gorgeous orange blooms on this on this plant and um, obviously when I saw this I couldn't walk away from it and they were fairly inexpensive these this plant was like seven dollars and really really beautiful and um, they also have beautiful pots and I have bought pots from there before and I found this beautiful terracotta pot which is rustic with this white border on top and beautiful uh, textured um, you know base uh, of the pot and it's just so beautiful and i feel with the um with the orange uh flower it really really looks good in this pot and i um just love it and what i like about uh, this pot is as well the height of the pot it's kind of nice and it goes with the shape of this plant um, and what's good about that nursery is that they would pot it for you if you buy a pot from there so um, this one was fairly inexpensive it, i think the pot was about 12 bucks um, and the and so they you know as a service they do offer repotting for you so they did pot it in this pot for me so i didn't have to do anything with this plant other than pick it um, get it potted and enjoy it at home. So uh, you, it's just a beautiful plant and it's really, really exciting to have this in the house and enjoy it. And always adding new plants to my home collection always feels so good, especially in the winter time. I really, really like bringing home some new plants in the winter because it just really, really brightens up your days and um, you know there's a lot of snow out there and it's really nice to enjoy um, some indoor plants in the winter so that's it I just thought I would take you along and show you um, what I was doing today I, I went for a quick visit and um, it's just really really filled my cup so give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching it and I and if you haven't subscribed to my channel my name is Preeti and I garden in zone 6 in Toronto and I'd love to have you as part of my gardening community. Do hit the subscribe button and um, I will catch you in my next video.